Hey everyone, so this is the look that I'm doing today. Um, sorry for the lighting, it's kind of different outside, so it gets a little weird. But this is like retro inspired. Um, I wanted to use my Relentlessly Red lipstick, which is a retro matte from MAC. And that's what I have on today. So I kind of did like the curls. I tried to do like the victory rolls, but I don't do hair and I just couldn't do it. But anyway, um, it's really, really simple. Um, again, it's inspired. It's not exactly. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. All right. Hello, everybody. So I'm going in with the 5-in-1 cream eyeshadow that I used as a base and obviously rubbing it all over my eyes so this look was just super simple I just loved how glamorous it all came out but honestly it, I wasn't trying to be too precise on anything so I'm going in with velvet vanilla from bare minerals it is a loose pigment and I'm just very lightly not even lightly um, <laughs> I'm just packing that on my eyelid and into that inner crease I mean inner corner um, just to kind of add highlight. That color right there, which I'm actually going to put way too much on because I used it wet, is called Antique Pearl. It is a discontinued color from Bare Minerals, and as you see, it kind of reminds me of Motif from MAC. It's like that yellowy, golden, pinky iridescent. Now I'm going in with, I believe it's Velvet Espresso. It's just a neutral brown um, with my 222 from MAC, and I'm literally like going as light as possible just above my crease not really in the crease and that's why you see more of a line almost like I'm trying to create a cut crease but I'm not really um, I just layer and layer and layer until I get the depth that I want from this color um, I didn't want it to be like a smokiness I, I wanted there to be definition so I'm going in with that velvet vanilla first and then I'm gonna go back in with um, some more of the brown and again it's just layering and light layers light layers to create a soft but sculpted type of look and I went back in with the velvet vanilla just to kind of you know soften everything up that is actually called blaze and it's a bright bright orange and you cannot to you cannot see it at all on camera but it just added some warmth to the look and I am adding um, underneath the highlight which I'm forgetting to mention I am adding some of the antique pearl very lightly um, and it will add like a nice little sheen to the eyelid and I will put everything I put on my face in the down bar if I didn't already mention it in the beginning which I don't think I did so that's that brown that espresso and that's about it so I hope you guys enjoyed it um, I realize I feel like my lashes look weird and it's because I forgot to put mascara on the other lash <laughs> But yeah, um, here's just a series of pictures, and thanks for watching, guys. Bye.